Alright, y'all, what is good, man? What's poppin', man? Uh, we got something a little different for y'all, man. Today, we got boxing. We're gonna be dropping some boxing. We got some freestyles to react to. And yeah, y'all let me know, man. I comment below what y'all want me to react to. Y'all know I'm gonna react to boxing because I box and it's a passion of mine. And I got a lot of bets that I put up on boxing and UFC. So, big fights coming up on Saturday, by the way. Um, we got the merch. Y'all caught the merch, man. Y'all support the merch. I am greater than. You know how we coming, man. Who are you if you're not greater than? That's our motto. Um, we got a whole bunch of videos I'm dropping, man. I'm dropping them on your head, man. We're dropping them back to back. I might drop five videos today. Fuck it. We're going to drop them back to back to back to back to back, man. Without further ado, let's get into this video. We're going to chop it up. Um, we're going we're gonna to put this into like three videos. Just, I, I, I need y'all to see what's really going on here. Like, this is a joke. If you could just give us a word on this fight, it is second time around. Your thoughts on finally getting in the ring with Raleigh Romero? Uh, first, I want to thank, again, everybody uh, for coming out. You know, I want to thank Showtime, Al Heyman, Mayweather Promotion, uh, you know, um, rolling in his camp for, you know, Stepping up to the plate and things like that. So, all right, we, we we've, already, negativity. we've been in camp. Let, let, this. Let, let's get the negativity, please. We, we, we want negativity. We're here for negativity. <laughs> the uh, first time we know we, you know, we came here to do this. Is not the first time we've been here, you know. We've seen that Rody choked up in the press conference when you know, lights and shit was in his face. So, we'll see come fight night when. You know what I mean? When everybody cheering against them and, you know, the bright lights and, you know what I mean? It, it's not just the fight. It's more so, like, everything leading up to the fight. You know that, you know, some people <clears throat> made I think it's going to be a murder, bro. I think he really want to, like, like, fuck his face up. Like, he just, he want to fight him. He don't want to box. Like, he really want to, like, you feel me? Like, that's how, that's how this shit turned out to be, bro. Do it and some people just, you know, talk that way through it. So, come fight night, it's going to be able to, you know, you're going to have to step up to that plate. I know some people, you know, uh, when, it, when it was my time, I ain't had no chance to look back or anything like that. I had to go walk through that door and become a man. So, it's his time now to see what he do. So, I'm going to be that guy to be, you know what I mean? It ain't going to be no easy walk. For sure. So, again, what my coach said, it ain't about nothing else. It's about respect. Nah, for real. I'm a man. He a man. And, you know what I mean? We got out our differences. And we'll just see who, you know what I mean, the last man standing come fight night. Talk your shit. Love it. Talk Settle those differences shit, in the baby. ring. You know, the challenge. Shit, bro. Number one contender in the WBA. That's how he's going to talk some dumb shit. 14 and 0. 12 knockouts. Rolling Romero. Hey, look, I want to say, I just want to say thank you, Showtime, Mayweather Promotions, Al Heyman, all of them. You know? <laughs> Yo, this nigga is disrespectful. You see how he said it all dumb, like, fuck them. Bro, come on, man. Bro, this nigga needs to be stopped, bro. Like, yo, what? What's in his head, like? Have y'all seen his fight? We we gonna show y'all his fights and his and his highlights and his sparring. A little bit of everything. For me to even get this opportunity a second time after everything that happened, you know, I'm beyond grateful. And you know, it's like I'm just really excited to be here in the heart of Brooklyn and May twenty eighth we're gonna see what's gonna happen. I'm gonna knock Tank out. <laughs> Let's talk about the fight. May twenty eighth, baby. Tank, I'll start with you. This venue has not held a fight since March of 2020. That's when the pandemic started. And yet, you're the first. And it's the place, of course, where you became a world champion. Oh, he go and I remember that night. That's the night you stopped Jose Pedraza. 
You were on the undercard. You were the co-main that night. Now you're the main event. Pay-per-view. What does it mean to you to be back here in Brooklyn, Barclays Center, where it all started? It means a lot, you know, um, just to see, like, how things, you know, play apart. You know, I won my first title here, and I'm, I'm back, you know, holding my own, you know, um, card and things like that. I'm grateful, you know, so I just want to be the best I could be, you know what I mean? Um, again, it's, it's, it's time for me to show that, you know, um, I'm that man. I'm the man of the sport. I believe that, you know, I'm the face, you know, um, of the uh, the lightweight division, you know, and it, you know, I'm just want to live up to that, you know what I mean? I just want to go out there and be better than I was yesterday, you know what I mean? So that's mainly what I'm focused on. Roly, same question to you. What does it mean to you? Not only to have this fight, it is pay-per-view, <laughs> But you're doing it Yo, all the places. Wait, we gonna hit New York City. Bit. This thing is a clown. Barclays Center here in Brooklyn. We got negativity. We got negativity. Well, I was supposed to spend, I was supposed to spend my birthday in, over here in New York, anyways. You know, so I mean, I just felt like you know, for me to have a good year, I'd have been here in Brooklyn. You know, so I mean, it's a legacy fight, and I'm excited to do it here at over here at the Barclays. That's you know it. But bro. I ain't gonna lie. You need to put Yes. Oh, he gonna slay it. Say you're a fairy. You're a pussy. You're a pussy. say he don't give a damn about no money so it's real smoke like you really want smoke bro like nah bro it's about the money now nah, don't don't do that don't do that don't do that but you you is gonna get you is gonna get knocked the fuck out but don't do that don't don't do the money part let's go let's get down like that Hey, Javante ready for him to slack off right now because he was talking, he was talking a lot of shit that he was going to see him and it's on site. So he trying to do it like he, he, he don't give a fuck about the press conference no more. Like he about to face off the press conference. He just don't give a fuck. He want to take it to the streets, bro. He told him like, hey, when you doing all that talking, when you see me in person, it ain't the same reaction. Like, you feel me? Because he, he just going off of what Roly been building up. You feel what I'm saying? So it's like, he been trolling him heavy, bro. This shit crazy. <laughs> Yo, I can't wait, bro. Y'all know I love this one. Okay. We, first of all, we gotta make sure that these is who they say they Because they, they be doing this for views. And they be putting like, oh, this Rody Romero against Ryan Garcia. And they really don't beat him. So let's, let's take a good look. Alright, that's definitely Rody Romero with his... Stupid ass. <laughs> Bro, you gonna get knocked the fuck out doing that shit. Let's see if that's Ryan. Oh, that's definitely Ryan. He looked younger though. Okay, I like the body shot. But his 
guard. Rolly guard right here at all times. You see, he's throwing the body shots, but when he come back up, his guard's still down here. Like, is, is that his guard? Like, his guard is hit. But you gonna get knocked the fuck. Bro, Tangle, bro. Oh, my. his guard down here, bro. <laughs> Look at this shit. Oh, he go, he go like this when he, when he, when he on defense. Look, look at his guard. Ryan, Ryan just trash. Ryan just trash though. Ryan gonna see his guard. Like, hey, like hey. He do look smaller here though. Ryan looks smaller. He look weaker. More than one, Orlando. More than one. Nice, nice body. But that's it. Look, his guard is here, and on defense, when he when when his opponent is on the attack, he do this. So he still got he still got his his left side open. What is this? That's the thing. That's the other cheap. That was nice. That was nice by Ryan. The other thing is, Rody don't jab, bro. And his guard down here. <laughs> oh my god, he killed me with the check. Like, but I'm gonna give Rody one thing though. He rough. Like he 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 make the fight like sluggish. Feel me? And a, a war, like a brutal, a brutal street fight. I like that about him, but he gonna get knocked out doing that against Tank. Like that that's power right there, bro. You can't you can't really like fuck around and do all that that dumb shit you be doing. You feel me? Like Ryan don't got no power especially in the video, Ryan got absolutely well he probably got some, you know, some <laughs> to the, the speed, some some <clears throat> to his punches with the speed, but it ain't no power when it hits you, it probably sting. You feel me? You gonna feel it, but it ain't gonna do nothing. You feel me? You could just brush it off, bite down, and, and you be straight. Ryan definitely letting them jabs go. See? He, that's one thing about it. See? He make the fight rough. See? That's, that's the only thing. But it's like... He got no skill, bro. Like, I can't watch. Y'all know how we gonna do it, man. We gonna make sure these who they said it is in the sparring, cause you know the headgear kind of throw shit off. So we gotta, we gotta identify first before we watch the video. But, <laughs> all right, we got Devin Haney. That was clearly Devin Haney. <laughs> oh, that's definitely Broly. <laughs> he making all that noise, bro. Like you feel me? Yeah, that's definitely him. Get this on camera, please. Wait though, wait, bro, bro, bro. So y'all, y'all mean to tell me y'all don't see him getting tagged up by Devin Haney, who who ain't who ain't who ain't got all that power. He ain't got much power. He got power, but it ain't like tanks. So what? If, I don't know if what Roly Tank, I mean Roly Camp was like. But if he ain't had nobody he was spawned with with power, he ain't gonna like. Come on, bro, be for real. And we saw we saw some we saw some spawn with Ryan Garcia, and he was smaller back then. He don't have no power now. Imagine back then. We saw Devin Haney just treating him like a little bit, like a little puppet, basically. So. Y'all, y'all do the math, bro. Y'all do the math. What it's looking like, it's gonna be easy work. I'm here for it. I got tank, fifth round knockout. 
Don't quote me on this. Don't blink. May 28th. Y'all come with a little high out feeling, man. What y'all think? You feel me? Let me know. What are Roly fans? I know there's Roly fans out there. But Tank, he just, he just, the truth, bro. Like, he just bring it every, every, every time. He don't talk too much. You feel me? He just go out there and do what he got to do. And that's it. If, if it's smoke, then it's smoke after. But you feel me? He just do what he got to do, bro. Like, all that talking shit. I do that, but I don't like when other fighters do it and can't back it up. Like, anyways, y'all see the like button and see you turn a blue, man. Comment below how you feeling, what video y'all want to see me do react to next, man. And y'all know how we get up. Yeah.